stayed up and turned on the TV. So, lifestyles on, ro on royal and famous. Suddenly, with the power. Cinderella. Mary your father. The prince grabbed a donut, put it on his, put it on her finger, then they rushed out the door to live happily ever after. <laughs> <laughs> Cinderella's bunions bothered, bothered her. She'd take off her shoes and leave them around town. The giant smelly shoes would block doorways, stop traffic, and would take up four parking spaces at the mall. So Who's that doll? Wanna dance? Let's check the light for the rest of the boy. What's your address? What's your phone number? What's your sign? Are you mad at me? I want you to go marry me. Reply, Cinderella. <laughs> the prince grabbed a donut and put it on her finger. They rushed out the door to live happily ever after. <laughs> <laughs> Cinderella put her feet up and turned on her favorite TV show, Lifestyle of the Royal Famous. So 
suddenly a cat wearing a blonde wig and a pink tutu. The worst problem for everyone else was that when Cinderella Bunyan sparkled two glass sneakers. I don't have a carriage. Mom, Cinderella. Take the bus. Said her fairy godmother handing Cinderella some change. Thank you, fairy godmother. Said Cinderella. She turned away. One more thing, said the cow. You have to be back before the clock strikes 12. Sure, sure, bye, said Cinderella. Prince Mildred, who was quite funny looking himself, raised his head from the punch bowl and sputtered. Who's the doll want to dance? Let's check the light fantastic thing. bothered her, she'd take off her shoes and leave them all around town. The giant smelly shoes would block doorways, stop traffic, and take up four parking spaces at the mall. Fantastic, big boy. 